right, so I'm going to experiment with some rhinestones that I found that were really pretty. Um, they're like sticker rhinestones from Michael's, uh, the Recollections collection, <laughs> I guess. It's got a little bit of an iridescent quality to it, and it was just something that I had from a previous project. So I'm going to give that a try to kind of give it some depth I think it would be really cool to make this work so I'm just gonna stick these in here I'll probably reinforce it with glue but I just wanted to show you kind of how I'm positioning those and then I'm gonna paint my wide pupiled eye chips from that same oh it is hello cool cat hmm. company and uh, place, once I've painted the uh, outside, then I'll stick those on. So we'll see how that works. Hopefully it'll turn out cool. Okay, so this is what I've been experimenting with so far for the eye chips. I used this nail polish, sparkly black, for the pupil. I don't know if you can really see, but anyway, that's the nail polish. Any black sparkly nail polish would do. And then I, for the first layer here, used something different. I used kind of a stained glass paint. And then I used a regular brush like this, just a really small one. And I painted all the way around, leaving the strokes in there. It may be difficult to see in this light, but I'll get a better shot of it. There, you can kind of see. But I'll get a better shot of it in a bit for you. And then I plan on doing a layer of sparkly Mod Podge and then possibly going back and doing a, another color in the in between where the green is. So we'll see how that works. I have Pearl X pigments too that I might use. I'm not 100% on that yet, but so far I'm really happy with the effect. I think it's kind of fun. Let's see. Uh, can you see it all? It is a really bad light, but you can kind of see a little bit. So we'll see how it looks on my Blythe. Okay, you guys. So the only thing that I've done really since I last made a video is... I put green pearls, pearlescent pigments in the eye. Um, I had painted in there and then I added the pearl. And now um, these eye chips that I showed you before, I've decided not to add any other color and to just allow the gem underneath to kind of add a little bit to it. And the way I'm going to actually glue it in is a little bit different than usual. I'm going to use this Mod Podge because I wanted to add the sparkles anyway. And I'm going to paint just over the entire thing. And then I'm just going to place them on. And it should be enough to stick and uh, we'll see how it goes. So let's do this. Jump to the left. And then you step to the right. Put your hands on your hips. 